Former House Speaker Kevin McCarthy is done with Congress. The California Republican announced in a Wall Street Journal op-ed that he's resigning at the end of the year to, quote, serve America in new ways. McCarthy's retirement ends a 16-year House career where he rose through the ranks of GOP leadership, becoming House Speaker earlier this year, and then being ousted in October in a revolt by hard-right members. McCarthy's departure means California Governor Gavin Newsom will now be calling a special election to replace him. But McCarthy is not the only one. Dozens of leaders are leaving Congress. Janae Bowen explains what's driving these departures. It seems just about every week a member announces they're leaving Congress. So far, 37 members announced they would not seek re-election in 2024. Some are running for other political offices. On top of that, nine leaders like former House Speaker Kevin McCarthy and former Congressman George Santos are leaving or were kicked out before their terms ended. And there is a mental, uh, there's a physical, emotional, even a spiritual exhaustion because of just all the different things you've got to keep up, the constant fundraising, all the different meetings. Former Congressman Mark Walker, who I used to do communications for, served for six years. He's looking to get reelected, but he admits serving in Congress is tough. When you're around the holidays and you're getting to spend time with your family and some of them for grandkids and you're missing those days, sometimes three out of four weeks, uh, you, get, you start to think, you say, look, uh, maybe I can find another place to serve or maybe I've done my time. The number sounds like a lot, but the Bipartisan Policy Center's Director of Structural Democracy, Michael Thorning, says this is normal. According to Ballopedia, he's right. In 2022, 55 members did not seek re-election, plus 16 left early. In 2020, 40 did not seek re-election, and 12 left early. I do think there is a general sentiment that um, members are, are unsatisfied with the job, they're unsatisfied um, with the the lack of civility in the chamber, and they just don't see the job um, as worth the costs. Thorning also says we should expect more retirement announcements in the coming weeks. In Washington, I'm Janae Bowens.